reading the basicmath.py file to evaluate and improve it. Evaluating the code for syntax errors and logic issues. Improving the code based on the evaluation suggestions. Writing tests for the functions in basicmath.py. Appending the tests to the basicmath.py file. Executing the basicmath.py file to test the code. Fixing the syntax issue with the calc underscore circumference function. Saving the updated code and tests to the basicmath.py file. Executing the updated basicmath.py file to test the code. The code in basicmath.py has been successfully evaluated, improved, and tested. The task is now complete. OpenAI created the spark that triggered an entire chain of AI tools that are now being developed by hackers, computer scientists, AI enthusiasts, and software engineers. It's a revolution that can't be ignored. Currently, the space is being tinkered with by nerds and persons who are passionate about the field. But the wider audience will soon live in this interesting future while these tools get better. ChatGPT, which is a large language model created by OpenAI, trained on a large corpus of text mainly from the internet, has already improved the lives of many around the world, and it now has the reputation of the fastest rising internet product of all time, prompting the likes of Google to completely shift their AI strategy overnight and focus on language models that can improve customers' lives. This interesting tool can basically act as a chatbot of sorts, an artificial entity that can do a lot of tasks that humans have mastered over the decades. For example, writing a research paper, reading and synthesizing computer code, review textual information, and compressing it into just a few lines, and showing the user just the important parts. It has been an absolute game changer, and we are only in the beginning stages of this game-changing technology. But as I stated in the very first lines of this essay, ChatGPT sparked a revolution, and the torch is now being passed on to others who are a part of this revolution. Currently we are seeing a new type of tool emerge that can be seen as ChatGPT on steroids. ChatGPT could be seen as one single AI agent that can do a multitude of tasks for us. What if we have multiple agents running around executing tasks for us from various domains, communicating with other AI agents in real time? This is exactly where we are headed, and the future is coming to us fast. On March 28, 2023, Yohei Nakajima who is a venture capitalist at Untapped Capital, released a thread on Twitter, showcasing his newest prototype of what the future of AI could look like. It is basically called Baby AGI. It is a task-driven autonomous agent designed to create, prioritize, and execute tasks based on the results of previous tasks and a predefined objective. This is built on top of OpenAI's large language model architecture with just 140 lines of code, a mere drop in the bucket, compared to typical project code base. Baby AGI has funnel another revolution with the AI space that is accelerating quite rapidly. Ever since the release of the code on GitHub, which is a repository that stores code for developers, other hackers, software engineers and enthusiasts, have been building on top of this project, and others have got inspiration from the project to create their very own grassroots technology. Baby AGI is a Python script that is used for AI-powered task management. It automates brainstorming and task management by creating tasks based on the results of previous tasks and a predefined objective. The system uses OpenAI and Pinecone APIs to create prioritize, and execute tasks. Baby AGI can also write and execute code, making it an even more powerful tool for developers. Even though it's still early stages, you can already see the layers on which the future is being shaped. Baby AGI works by operating in an infinite loop, constantly pulling tasks from a task list, executing them, enriching the results and creating new tasks based on the objective and the results of the previous task. The workflow consists of four main steps. Task execution. Baby AGI pulls a task from the task list and executes it. Result enrichment. Baby AGI enriches the result of the executed task by using OpenAI's NLP capabilities to extract information. Task creation. Baby 
AGI creates new tasks based on the objective and the results of the previous task. Task Prioritization Baby AGI prioritizes the newly created tasks based on their importance and assigns them to the task list. The purpose of Baby AGI in task management is to automate brainstorming and task management. It generates creative ideas, organizes them into tasks, and prioritizes those tasks to guide the user towards achieving their goal. The use of AI in task management has revolutionized the way we approach and handle our daily tasks. Baby AGI is an AI-powered task management system that is inspired by human cognitive development. It is an excellent tool for brainstorming and ideation, either as a standalone application, or as a component within a larger system. Approximately 48 hours after the publication of Baby AGI Auto GPT has been released to much fanfare from enthusiasts within the space, who want to utilize this technology. Similarly to Baby AGI, it has been built on top of OpenAI's large language model GPT-4, and is capable as well of performing tasks with little human intervention. While it is built on top OpenAI's framework, it is different in a multitude of ways, for example, it can self-prompt and produce every necessary prompt required to complete a task. AutoGPT relies on AI agents to make decisions and take actions based on predefined goals and rules. Companies are already utilizing this tool within their organizations for a competitive edge. Some are already touting as the closest thing we have currently to artificial general intelligence. Although AI skeptics would see this praise as too far-fetched, it's like having an autonomous agent that can do a lot of tasks for you such as marketing, analyzing the markets, customer service, etc. Why is AutoGPT so powerful? AutoGPT can review its work, build on its previous efforts, and use its history to produce more accurate results. AutoGPT to preserve context and make better decisions, which is important as we need an agent that can remember tasks. AutoGPT's capabilities, such as file manipulation, web browsing, and data retrieval, make it versatile and set it apart from previous AI advancements. It's like giving the robot multiple skills to handle a broader range of tasks. Given AutoGPT is a new technology, and for any new technology there are going to be limitations. Currently it's being used mainly by hackers and software engineers in the field who are optimistic about this technology and want to utilize within their workflow. Given that AutoGPT is built on top of GPT-4, it is constrained to what the model provides. It is basically amplifying the capabilities of the model. It's also not free. OpenAI charges for token consumption, which can go up pretty quickly if your tasks is long, complex, and filled with a lot of moving parts. GPT-4 tokens are charged at 3 cents per 1,000 tokens for prompts, and 6 cents per 1,000 tokens for results. For example, a small task requiring 50 steps, with each step maxing out the 8K context window, would cost $14.4. Your agent can at times get stuck in a loop, researching deeper within a network of information, without achieving the objective set by the client. This can be a major deal breaker because it can grow your API costs quite drastically. In order to run these popular auto GPTs, you need to install them locally, and that requires some kind of programming experience. Since it runs on Python, and requires OpenAI and Pinnacone API keys. However, there are already auto GPT apps that run on the browser, like Agent GPT and Cognices. Baby AGI can also run on a browser via this hugging face space. Regardless of the drawbacks of auto GPT and other new AJI agents, the future is here and there is no going back, we are pacing forward into a brave new world. Given that these applications are not even a month old and is taking the industry by storm, imagine these technologies over the span of five years to a decade, the applications and value to society will be immense. Yes, we are in for a generational societal shift, but that's just the nature of the beast, and what comes with the territory if we want to progress.